Hi. Some, some of the most popular silver today is made by George Jensen. And um, people are always asking me, what's your favorite Jensen pattern? And for many years, the answer has been the same. I like the blossom pattern. This pattern, which has a three-dimensional lotus blossom, was created by George Jensen himself in the year 1919. I think it's a blending of silverware and jewelry. They made not only flatware, they made tea sets, they made trays, they made bowls, they, they made candelabras, they made everything under the sun in this pattern. I think the knives are a work of art. In the 1980s, I went to Copenhagen and at George Jensen they had a, a film about the creating of the blossom and they showed a craftsman making a knife and he started with a flat piece of silver he cut it he formed it and then he fit it into this handle absolutely you know all handmade hand hammered hand done it is the very top of Jensen's line in the 1990s one knife like this was a thousand dollars Amazingly, butter spreaders, which also had the pierced handle, were about 800. So, not not inexpensive by any means, but absolutely the best. I have other place pieces here: spoon, a salad fork, a fork, and oval soup. You can see the beautiful hammering on the backs of the pieces. I've had people say. Yeah, but it's really hard to eat with. Yeah, yeah, it is, it is difficult to eat with, I agree, but, you know, it's such a fun pattern. They all have little difficulties. Here's a, a really neat piece. Uh, this one actually just sold with the pie server. Uh, this is a pastry server, and so these two pieces will be going in, in the mail uh, today. Despite the prices, it sells very well. Okay, so that that is my favorite, but there's a lot of other Jensen patterns and I should talk a little bit about some of the others. Another one that, that I really like is Caravel. This pattern was created in the year 1957. This is what you call a spoon. Look at the design on this thing and the size of it. It's really cool. Everything was special about this pattern. It was created by Henning Koppel, who worked for George Jensen. Look at this gravy ladle. It's just totally different than anything else I've ever seen. Here is, it took me a little while to figure out what it was when it came in. There were a dozen of them, and I thought, what the heck, is it some sort of a jelly server, or what is it? Thinking, I finally came up with, it's obviously a fish knife. But look at that shape. And then another one, here is the butter spreader. Completely different than any other pattern. The place setting is really neat too. Look at that for sleek. That, that's the knife. Forks, here's a dinner fork. Here's a salad fork, so four tine and three tine. And then even the spoons are interesting in their shape. The Pattern won a gold medal in Denmark in 1963 as best design. What other Jensen patterns do I really like? Well, I really like almost all of them, but some of them that I really like, the pyramid is very popular. It's so strong a pattern. The beaded. Uh, the knives, I think, are dynamite. You know, there's these big beads that go around the top, the hand hammering, really good looking stuff. One that we can't keep in stock here is the cactus. And it, it's just a, a great looking pattern, very simple. And then another interesting pattern is parallel, just simple, but it is really cool looking, especially in the hollow handles. My daughter Pam's pattern is scroll, all hand done. 
interesting looking pattern. One story about this was about 20 years ago, we were at a show, we had just gotten a big set of this in. She was like, I really like that. I said, well, I'll sell it to you at cost. And she looked at it and she's like, I can't make up my mind. Well, of course, someone about half hour into the show bought the entire thing and she was crushed about 20 years later, this year, well actually, uh, within the last year, another really nice set of it came in. She bought it and I was adding to it and it is her pattern. Thank you.